Hello boys and girls and welcome to another video. Today I want to talk about how I beat the number 12 sumo player in the entire world. First of all, so you actually believe me, here is the screenshot of it. Yep, there you go. Sadly I didn't record this game, otherwise that would have been one of the best shorts on my channel so far probably. But now we are about to take out the wonderful little red person, come here. Oh my god, what are they doing? But okay, I got a good cop. <laughs> I am pretty sure that I already mentioned this in the video where I reached the Sumo Legend Division title, but this actually convinced me to record all of my Sumo games I play from now on. I usually play Sumo to warm up on Hypixel before doing anything else, and also to get the 10 daily quests. And let me tell you, I got lots of great Sumo shorts coming for you in January. Another thing I wanted to talk about is recently I've been re-watching a lot of Hashido content again, you know, the number one solo Bowers player of all time, and that really motivated me to play solos. It is an insanely hard game mode, but I like the challenge. I will also get a heart rate monitor soon, as Hashido also uses one in most of their videos, or I'm not sure if most videos, some Hashido videos definitely feature a heart rate monitor, and that's always pretty interesting to see. Speaking of pretty interesting to see, it's pretty interesting to see if I'm actually able to beat Green Man here. Oh, what? Uh, no! Okay, frick. So, uh, my bed is gone, but at least I still have 8 emeralds. Let's see... Yeah, my bed is gone. Let's see if we can beat him here. Don't hit me off. Okay, good. I hit them off. So, Shido uses that heart rate monitor in some of their videos, and I already have a smaller version of it, but I can't really connect that to my PC. I can still look at my heart rate and stuff like that, but I can connect it to my PC. Also, green man is incoming. What are they gonna do? Okay, are they gonna come in, or...? What you do, green man? Oh, you're gonna block it off? Well, I have shears. Oh, oh, wait. Just good that I have a diamond sword. I should be able to beat him here. And that should be it. Yeah, okay, I got him. Just the other day, actually, I was playing a game of solo Bowers, and I was using that little heart rate monitor that I can connect to my PC to see what my uh, heart rate basically is and where it peaks and stuff. And let me tell you that much, I had a really, really insane game. Okay, please don't hit me. I should be able to get their bed. Yeah, okay, I'm totally able to get their bed here, even if they have a trap, which they actually do. Oh, wait. Oh my god. Oh my god! Uh, eek. Yeah, okay, I have him. <laughs> oh my god, that was a little... Whew sweaty. So yeah, I had a really insane game the other day. I had to fight someone that was abusing a punch bow. So I had to utilize parts a lot, especially invis, but in the end they actually uncovered my invis just before I was able to hit them off the edge and it was really really dangerous. They already started hitting me with their punch bow a lot, so really quickly I was out of the range to hit them and I was taking a lot of damage since punch bows just deal an unimaginable amount of damage. Sadly my bed was already gone, so in that situation it was either me or you. Luckily I remembered I still have a fireball, so I shot a fireball, it was pretty risky since can just easily deflect fireballs with arrows and that guy was basically just punch bow spamming me so I already saw that plan failing but actually it worked the fireball landed right in their face and they got thrown off the edge that game was actually so intense my heart rate spiked at 192 like what 192 I mean come on so yeah, heart rate monitor that I can connect to my PC to display it on screen and streams and videos will be pretty fun. But now that I'm done with all of that commentary stuff that's all out of the way, how about we concentrate on the video game here? I'm pretty confident that we are actually going to win this since I just saw white goofing around and going for different bases, also what just happened there. Looks like I almost got stuck in a slap. So yeah, while white is still goofing around, I'll go towards their base, yeah it doesn't look like they will be in common anytime soon. And now, as soon as I took their bed, here we go. I don't think I should lose this like ever. I have like substantially stronger gear and also I have a bunch of parts. I'm just going to inverse rush them. I see them in the corner of my eye actually, goofing around at mid. And also I still have a pearl, so even if they somehow managed to hit me off, it shouldn't matter that much since I just basically have a pearl. 
Okay, I miss that. Let's pre-gap once more. I'm pretty confident on finding them. I just saw them at mid. Of course, I could just be wasting my pots here, which it actually looks like. Where are they? Oh, I see them. Okay. They are probably about to come back to mid. Indeed, it looks like. Yeah. Yeah, okay. They're gonna come mid, so I can just hit them off. And there you go, dear sir. Wait, they disappeared. Help, help. Okay. <laughs> Holy, I hate when that happens. Uh, whatever, I hope you enjoyed today's video and goodbye.